searching. All right, I've had this for a couple days. Please open the power So just turn it off. Uh, you can see it said, please open the power switch. So the grammar is kind of bad because uh, it meant please turn on the power switch. Uh, the biggest thing that I'd say is a negative for this is the instructions are pretty confusing, especially the, the scheduling part. And then that in and of itself isn't that great. But if I uh, basically run it four times, so let's see how it's done collecting dirt, since that's the whole point. Well, yeah, the hopper is full. So a lot of dust, corn chips, whatnot. So I'd say that's pretty good. So yeah, so far I think I've run this, say, four times. And basically my takeaway is it does a fairly good job vacuuming. It does a fairly good na na job navigating. Uh, the biggest thing that it's lacking is really the scheduling. It's confusing to set up, but really what's confusing or disappointing is it's a basically all or nothing type of scheduling because if you turn it on then it's on every day so if, you know I was hoping you could have it basically vacuum you know Monday Wednesday Friday or something but if you turn scheduling on it's basically a, a cleaning mode so you have to turn it on and off every day but it's you actually have to reset it back to zero 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 to not have it scheduled so not that great so basically I've just used the uh, random cleaning mode which basically just does what it does. There's also a spiral, which is sort of like, I think, the spot mode, because it'll find a dirty spot and then do spirals. Uh, I've just done the regular mode uh, with the UV light, and the machine itself only got stuck once, and that was on a, a charging cable, basically got kind of wrapped around the brush wheel, and it just turned off, so that was good. Uh, let's see, it sensed my stairs, so it didn't go down the stairs. Uh, for the most part, I just will turn it on manually, I'll let it run for a bit as I'm just doing stuff around the house, and then send it home. I haven't just left it on and left the house and let it find its way back home. I'm sure that'd be fine, but uh, for the most part, it's been, uh, it's been all right uh, as is. So I'm pretty happy, you know, for the price. I've never had a Roomba or anything, so I don't really have a, anything to compare it with, but, you know, I'd say that sort of a general house area that it works in is definitely cleaner and I can see there's quite a bit of dirt so less vacuuming to do on the weekend because you know basically running this every other day kind of picks up all that dust and crumbs and all the stuff that gets around so I'd say that's pretty good I just wish the scheduling was a little better than it is but for the price I think uh, so far fairly happy with it and look forward to just using it some more